game. Disappointed, uh, but give CC credit. You know what? They came in here and they battled two nights in a row. And uh, you know what? We could never get anything going. We had, uh, I don't know, clawed, scratched for everything. We never got any flow to our game. They clogged up the, the zone. They defended well. Um, and I you know, still was a one goal game, but give them credit. That clogging up tight defensive style of play, did you guys feel like you handled it maybe better against Bemidji than you did this weekend against CC? I, I don't know. I, at times, at times, it was different. I mean, you're going through three guys all the time in the neutral zone. We didn't manage the puck very well. We didn't support the puck very well. Um, so uh, when, you, when you don't do that, you got to make short little plays and chips and things like that that we didn't execute. Certainly had some opportunities in the power play. We had chances to score, uh, but just overall, we just couldn't get anything going. We never really, you know, had that jump or whatever. There was no real good flow to the game. We had some good shifts, but not good enough. And uh, it's a good lesson for us. So we come to work on Monday and get ready for St. Cloud. Did you feel that the effort was good enough by the team tonight to pull away with the win? Uh, no, it wasn't. It wasn't good enough. No, it wasn't good enough. We've got to be better. And maybe this is a good learning lesson for us. Because we're going to go on and take it one of two ways. We're going to get back to work on Monday and come with a, a good attitude, realize we've got a lot of work to do, and uh, get ready for St. Cloud. We've got to put it behind us. We've got points over the weekend. It's not as many as we wanted, but we've got points. It's important. This league's tough. <laughs> anybody can beat anybody. Scouts, is there something specific you'd like to see the team do a little better? Is it be more patient? Is it pass the puck better, move the puck better? No, I think taking on these our execution is hard. It's hard because you can't make a lot of clean plays. You may defend it well, and like I said, coming through the neutral zone, you don't have a lot of space. You've got to make good decisions with the puck. You've got to have good support on the puck, and you've got to win battles. And we've made some slow decisions. We didn't execute with the puck. We didn't, uh, we didn't make a lot of clean plays. You know, I, think, I think guys were trying. But I, I, I still don't think we had that that jump that we normally do, and maybe it's maybe it's too long. We've had too many layoffs. I don't know. I'm not going to make excuses. I'm going to give CC credit for the way they play. And, and they played hard, and they came in here and executed uh, their game plan, and, and, they, and they won the they won the game today. Well, assessment of the game and how you guys came out tonight. Uh, I don't know. Just came out flat. Came out expecting. Expecting it to be too easy. CC's a good team. Just didn't give him enough credit. You said came out expecting it to be a little too easy. Was that the mindset coming into the weekend? Or did you guys think it would be a little easier tonight than it was last night? Or? You try not to think so, that, but I don't know. You know, with our rankings, with whatever, people look into it. You know, that's our job as leaders. Get our guys prepared every night, but you know, we came with flat both nights. That's, that's all acceptable. This clogging, muck it up style, the you know, you've seen the midget play and the CC play this weekend. Well, why is it that that gives you guys such trouble out, out there? Just didn't manage our puck. We just it limits it limits our speed. Mm -hmm. You know, we try to get too fancy after times after getting fr frustrated with the puck, and then you know we don't take care of it, and that just leads to their offense. That's just, that's what they do. They did a good job of it, but you know we just didn't take care of the puck. How much does this style of play force you guys out of your style? And is there any way to, to break it up and, and maybe try and get them playing your game? There is. I mean, you saw last night in the third period, we did we did what we have to do to beat it. But then, you know, came on tonight, we tried, tried to get back to what we were doing the first two yesterday, and it just didn't work. Yeah. What would you like to see different from the team going into the second half? No. Uh, just going to expect it to be harder. It's the second half now. Uh, every team's been gunning. You know, they got to. They want to get up in the sands, they want to get up in the paralyzed, so every team's going to be going. We just got to, you know, we got to prepare throughout the week. We got to prepare, prepare for another battle, and that's that's what we didn't do as well this week. So we're going to come back and get ready to go. You guys are, Coach always talks about going through the process. What can you learn from a weekend like this? But we can't come, behind, come from behind all the time, even no matter what team is going to be against some of the better teams, against, you know, even some of the lower teams, it's going to bite you again up that first goal, giving up that early lead. You can't come behind all the time. Like we did last time, we got lucky. Um, I just asked Seuss this. Nice Coach talks about it all the time yeah. going through the process. What is it that this team can learn from, from this weekend as you guys go through the process and, and go through the season? 
Well, you can't take uh, can't take any periods off. Can't take any shifts off. I mean, every team's good in this league, and they're gonna make you pay for it. What's the key you know, here as a forward for you guys to really break through with these, these teams that, that muck it up, clock it up, and, and try and slow down? You just gotta work hard. You gotta hope to beat them. I mean, yeah. they're, uh, they, they did a good job, um, and we gotta learn from it. Is there a way for you guys to break that up and, and, and kind of get a game into the fast flowing style of play that you guys like, or, or does it require some patience to, to play a team? Like CC or Bemidji or whatever. Well, obviously you need patience, um, and you gotta you gotta stay positive. You can't get frustrated. Uh, those teams are are gonna frustrate you, and uh, you just gotta stick with with our game plan. Any frustration out there for you guys tonight as this game wore on? Uh, I mean, I, there's a little bit, but we kept it together. Have you guys engaged in that short-term memory, forget about tonight, and then get ready for St. Cloud? Well, I mean, it's it's a learning. It's a learning, uh, game, learning weekend for us. Um, I mean, we gotta we gotta come back next week. Uh, we gotta work hard and get ready for uh, St. Cloud. All right.